Hey, what's happening, guys? Spash, welcome back. <coughs> Just went out for my smoke. Um, and I got myself some, uh, some Raspberry Fanta. Because that shit is the bomb. If, you've ha if you haven't had Raspberry Fanta, you have not lived. Um... I was just thinking maybe, uh, I'll probably put, um, I'll probably put all these parts into just one playlist, like a quest to level cap playlist, just so they're easier to get to. Um, I doubt, I doubt anyone's going to go and watch every single one of them and watch me level from, uh, all the way from 1 to 100 or whatever the, uh, level cap happens to be by the time I'm, uh, by the time I get to it, um, I, I, yeah, I doubt anyone's gonna do that, but I'm gonna put it there anyway, just cause it's, just in case, I mean, I'm not a big, a big YouTube channel yet, but eventually, it, it'll happen eventually, well, I mean, it won't happen eventually, it's not guaranteed to happen or anything, but, and I don't want to get too cocky about it, but it's fun. It's fun to do this shit. It's fun to uh, post videos and stuff. It gives me something to do, and yeah, I'll just make the videos more easily available, I guess. <sighs> I was uh, actually just thinking on some topics to talk about. Um, my dad actually plays. Uh, actually plays WoW. Um, he originally started playing, um, a little while after me, um, he's got way more hundreds than me, because that's the only game he plays, so he just focuses mainly on that, um, well, mainly on WoW, um, and he's way better than he thought he was going to be, he thought he was not going to be able to do this at all, um, and then he, I mean, year and a half, two years after he started, uh, he started up, he actually, um, he actually got into one of the top guilds in the server, uh, at that point in time, uh, which was Cataclysm. And they're, actually, they're actually one of the, uh, the, one of the top guilds in the Oceanic, I think. Um, he was in there for a little while, raided with them and that. Um, and it, it just proves, like, I mean, he's now addicted to WoW. I kind of feel bad every time he, um... I can hear him, like, yelling at something that's, like, hasn't gone his way, I guess you'd say, in WoW. Because I feel like, oh, I'm like, oh, shit, you know. If it wasn't for me, like, he wouldn't be, uh, cursing and swearing at this game. Um, but if it wasn't for me, instead of that turtle fin, scared the shit out of me. <coughs> turtle fin, lol. Um... But then I also, I also go around and I think, but, I mean, if it wasn't for me, he would probably get home from work, just sit down and, like every other, I guess, average Joe, watch TV, until, uh, until, uh, watch TV until tea was ready or whatever, and then, um, and then just go to bed, like, you know, um, and that and that that really comes down to people always say like WoW players, um, you know it's it's not good playing WoW because they've seen certain th things like certain documentaries and that that show like WoW addicts and how addicted they are to the game. And I mean, in my opinion, I don't I don't see it as like a bad thing. I mean. If he was just coming home, if my dad was just coming home and like watching TV for uh, for a heap of hours, just waiting for like tea to be cooked or whatever, um, like I believe that would actually be worse because he's not really doing anything other than sitting there and watching TV. Mm -hmm. At least this, although it's virtual, and I know it opens up the age-old argument. Oh, you know. Um, it opens up that age-old argument of, like, oh, like, 
you know, WoW players, um, you know, WoW, WoW's a bad game, um, and WoW players, just all these addicts, or these, like, these fat virgins that, like, live in their mum's basement or whatever, which isn't the case at all, um, I mean, if it wasn't for WoW, he, as I said, he'd just be coming home, sitting around, and, uh, watching TV, and in the, uh, in the long run, what do you think is, uh, is better? Um, I believe, wow, you know, I believe, like, obviously I think wow, because I'm a wow player, but if it wasn't for wow, he would just be doing nothing, like, he, in the eyes of every, of everyone that doesn't play games, or doesn't like wow, they're against it or whatever, um, he doesn't do anything now, I guess you'd say, but I mean, it's more brain activity, it gives him something to do rather than just sitting around and just, you know, watching TV, or sitting around, um, I mean, well, really that's all he would be doing if it wasn't for WoW. I remember how he said back in the day, because... <sighs> Ages ago, I never used to play Horde. Like, when I first started up, my friends played Alliance. And it was really weird. Because I, I knew they played WoW. Uh, I knew they played as Alliance. Um, but I didn't know what server. And when I got WoW, I was like, hmm. Um, I don't really know what server to pick. So I picked uh, an Oceanic, small Oceanic server, PvE, uh, known as a Mumthol. Or a, a manthal, something like that. And I played um, an I, I played a a knight elf oh, druid um, called Scepter. And next thing you know, um, I'm talking to my friends, and they're like, "Whoa, yo, I my main character's on a manthal as well." And it was just somehow that um, I managed to. Uh, I managed to pick that um, a month I was the server to play on. Now I don't play on a month I play uh, my main server is Thorasan now, which is a PvP server. Um, what? Oh. Uh, which is a PvP server. Um, it's good to see you. On Oceanic as well, um, and now I play as Horde. I, I change factions. Jesus Christ, we're gonna go back on this yak again. Okay, fine. We're two guys. Oh, do they sit? In, they sit in the cart. Except that guy. Why does this guy get to sit in the cart? But this guy has to run behind. This guy's like more, uh, most prestigious or something. And, yep, yeah. so what ended up happening was Dad made a, uh, a dwarf hunter way back at the first ever character. And he likes to give them stupid names, he doesn't give them any serious names. Um, all these characters, like, he has a monk that's called Monk the Monk. And, uh, <laughs> when I heard that name I was like, well, really? And he's got a, he's, it's a level 90 monk, like, he, like, didn't just, like, make it, um, at level 1 and then just you know, level it up 10 levels or whatever, and, uh, and then quit, like, he literally got it to, uh, to Pandaria cap, um, without, without a 90 boost or anything, um, yeah, and, uh, his first of a character was actually a dwarf hunter that I think he got to, like, level 28 or 29 before he changed to Horde and to Thorasan, and, um, it was called Weed Eater, and, uh, he was on a month old as well, and that's what he used to play on when he was, when he was a noob, and, um, he was actually a reason that, he, he's, he's the most major reason I now play on Horde and on the server Thorasan, as well as, um, as well as all my friends as well, they, um, they all changed to Horde and to Thorasan, and it really only, it really all started, uh, with, with Dad. We became for the horde. Our greatest new return with the spirits of water. Sweet, level nine. Level nine achieved.
Oh my god, Raspberry Fan. So good. I think we get to choose faction soon, don't we? Uh, I got my sister online. I'll get her to uh, log over onto one of Dad's characters to add me. Um, who knows how long that will take? Cause she probably won't know what she's doing. Uh, Cause I need a, I need a, I need an addy to the guild, <coughs> which I couldn't do before because I needed to be. Uh, I need to get to level ten or whatever it is to pick your faction. Not really, buddy. Look at that. Professional rolling skills. Um, but yeah. So now, now we're for the Horde. Um, we play on Thorasan, and that's all because of, uh... And that's all because of Dad, really. Um... Semter, I think he's almost level 70. I just never got him past level 70. Because uh, that's back when I was noob. And, it, like, it was hilarious. I used to play Semter, um, and he used to be a level... I, I, he used to be... I, like, I used to do dungeons with him. Um, and he would get... And he would... Um, I do all these dungeons, and I just loot anything that had more armor. I think that's a, what a lot of people used to do. Um, Time to act. When you're a noob, I think you just think like more armors, like best, obviously. Um, yeah, I didn't know what stats I needed for my druid or anything, so. Speak up. Enough of that. You are most. I actually don't know what stats I need for this guy. I mean, they don't really matter until until later, like really late levels, like Warlord of Draenor levels. At the moment. What do I do? We need to loot these guys. Is that 100% drop rate? Please? I mean, with this series, I'm, I, I won't lie, I'm kind of pumped. I'm kind of pumped to uh, to do something a bit different when I level, and level a, level a guy completely to uh, level cap with, um, level, level a guy completely to level cap just by, um, just by questing. It's something I've never done before. Um, yeah. So I mean, I think I'm gonna have. I think I'm gonna enjoy it. I may get bored in some parts because some of the quests, a lot of the quests are very repetitive, as we all know. That thing. I remember these Malchite uh, diamond things used to get up. Used to get a heap of them um, when I was level in Semter, and it was just. Pull our own tail, and there are other tails to pull. Well. Um, and I, <laughs> we, we still use it as a joke today, I used to say to mum, oh, I'm never gonna get a gold, I'm never gonna get a gold, like I was real pissed off, like the first time I ever played, wet for not fun to sleep on, um, yeah, no, it was used to be this mad joke that we used to have, and we still, we still all laugh about it, uh, especially now since I've got like, a f somewhat a fair bit of gold. I'd say. Um, yeah, and like, I just, I just, like, I thought getting one gold was like the biggest accomplishment. Like, I thought, I was like, man, I'm so rich. When I got my first gold, when I finally amassed enough to get my first gold, I was like, holy crap, man, I am the richest person. Um, and these Malchites like crafting reagent things, I was like, whoa, you can sell them for 50 copper? Holy crap, man. That's gonna, that's like halfway to one silver. Holy crap, man, I'm gonna be so rich. Um. <laughs> yeah, and. 
basically what happened was uh, I I got good at the game and I realized 50 copper is barely worth selling. It actually you can actually earn more more uh, more more shit from not going from the amount of time it takes you to go somewhere and actually sell that. Do I have all these? No, I don't have them turned on. I need mailbox repair. Um, is that all I usually have on? Can't remember. I think so. Um, flight master, track pets, focus target, track quest PIO, um, track dig sites I want to dig. I don't give a shit about digging. Um, we'll sell this shit. There we go. Um, yeah. So with this series, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty well pumped for, um, for constant questing. Um, I think I'm going to be able to see the uh, world a lot more. I know I did, at least up till level th 30 or something. Like, I remember my best moments in WoW was, uh, when I... My best moments in WoW was when me and my friends would go questing, um... Me and my druid, them on whatever new character they ended up making, uh, to quest with me. Um, and we'd just go and, like, I remember one time we were, like, level f level 10 or something, I think, and we were like, yo, you know what? I have the perfect, I have the perfect plan. Let's go to somewhere where there is... Let's go somewhere where there's, like a higher level zone, you know? Um, and this is why it took me forever to level anything back in the day. Simply because I was just fucking around so much. Um, yeah, um, and we went... I think we were questing in Westfall. And I was just like, you know what, screw that. Let's go to the next zone, even though we weren't, uh the level to go there yet, and we went to, uh, what's it called? I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm actually gonna do it. I'm gonna go all the way to check it out. Uh, we were in Westfall, we were in, where's Westfall? Where's Westfall on this map there? We went down to, that's right, Duskwood. We went to Duskwood, which was, which, 20 to 25 leveling zone, and I was like, we were there, and I think there was like a level I think it was like a level, yeah, it was like a level 20 something spider, or 19 spider, and it started chasing after us, and we were like, we were running, we were like, oh my god, we're gonna die, this spider is gonna absolutely wreck us, and we were running, my friend was like, my, Kingy, my friend was just like, man, I don't want to move from where I am right now, because if we move, yo, know, I possibly could uh, aggro something and die, we were, like, running away from, like, some level 20 spider, it was the funniest shit when you look back on it. Um, and those moments, like, are, even though they're not, like, a big achievement or anything, I cherish them. And it's just what's good about WoW, especially when you can play with friends. Um, especially when you can play with friends, because it's just, it's just so fun. Just, like just like having those experiences where you get fucked over by things at what at like a, a level a high level is just an absolute joke to get fucked over by those are always the best <laughs> I can't even loot these, what the fuck? Oh, there we go. Um, how many more of these do we need? Is that all we need to do? Ruck, ruck. I guess we start making our way to Ruck, ruck. Where is he? We'll corner this one off. Thanks, bro. We stun him straight off the bat. Oh, he didn't get stunned. Oh, 
good going. I'm with you. Need a couple more monkeys. Since I've got all the BOA gear on, I don't actually know. I'd assume it'd normally be level level ten that we'd um. Speaking of level ten, <laughs> level ten that we pick. Uh, maybe it's level fifteen. We pick our uh, hoarder alliance. Don't really know. Um, oops. Let's take out that guy first. Get wrecked, son. Okay. Specs. So we got the. I could never remember what they were called. I used to have a brewmaster monk. That I. Oops. Accidentally hit the wrong button. That I made for um. That I made got to like level eleven or something. But we're gonna go the wind walker. The damage. Because I don't, I need, I'm just going to be questing throughout the whole thing, so I don't want to be a healer, obviously. I want to do damage, because healing doesn't really come into effect at all with quests. Mm -hmm. um, it's just a bit slower at leveling, which we want to be as fast as possible. Um, and I don't want to be tanked, because I want to pop out damage. And if I if I would be dungeoning, I would have uh, I would have went tank. Um, obviously for quicker queues, but yeah. I mean, oh, this is pretty fun. I remember this. Uh. Look at that. How's that for testing your gamer skills? Oh 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 oh. Look at that. I feel just like. A real monk. Locate the fang. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, buddy. Um, so, well, yeah, what I'm going to try and do with this series is if I do a day where I put up at least one quest level cap, I want to try and put up, at the bare minimum, two parts to quest for the le quest level cap. Um, what was the new spell we got actually? Fist of Fury. Pummel all targets in front of you, stunning them and dealing 529 damage over 2.83 seconds. Deal deals reduce damage to secondary targets, okay. Um I'll leave that there. That's good enough. I'm gonna walk so far. Um Yeah, I mean I put up probably two parts, that's why I'm doing two parts at least at the moment, I don't know if I'll do any more or if this part will be my last part for tonight um, I'm not really tired yet but I also don't feel like playing to a great deal but I don't want to truck, chuck a Crendor where our Crendor is I basically oh shit What is going on here? How was that, bitch? Oh fuck! Oh shit! I didn't realize. I'll meet you on the far side. Wait for another opening. I'll meet you on the far side. Oh god! Oh, I'm lucky there. Would you stop fucking winding, bro? What's Christ. Why are you hiding back here? That ability is not ready. Um, yeah, I mean, I mean I've been I, I watched I think Krendar Krend Krendas. Krendor's first part to his um to basically his own quest a level cap type deal series deal. Um 
I'm gonna slay this thing. Shit. And he has taken so long. And I'm not even joking. He has taken so long to um to uh, level up. Like he's not even level 60 yet. I see what I meant to do. Um. And he's taken so long to uh, hit level cap. Like, he's only level 60 at the moment. I mean, I don't know. It's just taken him so long. Because he's only posting like one part a week or something. And it's like a 15 minute video. That's why I decided to do 30 minutes in one video. Uh, it, may be, it may, to some people, seem a bit overkill. But, um, I don't know, it's, it works, um, plus, I mean, 15 minutes, I feel, I feel like it's just, um, 15 minutes, I feel like it's not long enough to, uh, do what you want to do. Is this new spell? Fist of Fury, man, I just punched that bitch to death. So that's why I decided to go like double that and go for go for about 30 minutes per um per part. And that's why when I upload when I do upload a quest to level cap video, I want to upload at least two parts for that one day, which is about an hour of playtime. Still not that much, but it's two parts minimum. I don't want to flood the channel just with uh, like quest to level cap videos. I mean, there may be some weeks that nothing happens, especially when the Black Rock Mountain expansion thingy ends. Um, that's when I will... We just kill everything. <laughs> um, that's when I'll probably uh, start posting way more parts, like two or three parts a day. For like a week straight, you know? And I just feel that then I can actually keep up. I can actually get a fair few levels on this guy in that amount of time, and at the same time, um, I won't. I won't take you know a hundred years to actually get to to level cap. Because um, if I take too long, obviously I'm just I'm just not going to end up getting it done, which I don't want to happen. Like, I think we're almost on the 30 minute mark now by my calculations. We so, I don't know. I'll check after this quest, after I kill these guys. That's so OP. What do we got to get here? Kunpire ritual charms. Uh. I mean, I hope some people watch this, watch these things, watch a large amount of them, uh, the parts. I don't expect someone to actually sit through and watch me level f all the way from from one to a hundred or whatever it happens to be the qu the the cap. I don't expect that at all, because that's um that's a fair way. Um, and in that amount of time probably quicker than that even because I'm I'm a kind of slow leveler um I'll um they could hit potentially uh, level cap themselves um since this is actually being you know every I'm trying to get every single second more or less of of the questing uh in a video that way, you know, it's just not going to work out. Hmm. Like, it's just not going to work out. I know it's. I know no one's going to sit down and, like, watch every second of every single part uh, of every single video. Uh, and I don't really blame them. Um, 
other than that, I mean, I could cop some flack for people saying, you know, why would you do all this uh, and film it all. Um, I don't know. I felt like leveling an ult anyway, and I was like, well, it gives me content for the channel. And when I say that, people think like I'm talking like, as in my channel being like, to the capacity that something like PewDiePie's channel is, which, no. Um, I'm not talking about that. And then people say, well, why do you do it? Well, if PewDiePie never did it, like, he, it's not like he posted his, he started his channel, posted his first video that day, and then came back and he had, you know, 20, mil, 20 million subscribers or whatever he has. Um, at least I don't think that's how it happened. I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> but, yeah, I mean, channel could go somewhere, it could go nowhere, but I enjoy making videos for it regardless. Um, some people watch them, some people get tips, you know. If you never try, you never will succeed. Sounds very pandaren, but it's the truth. God. Oh my god. Hurry up. So you mean to tell me that no one's talked to this Shenzhen Su for th thousands of years and you want me to talk to him? A level 11 Pandaren that was just born. Makes sense. I'm a level 11 man, like I don't even, don't trust that type. Where did he go? Did he just turn... He just turned into the staff? Did he die? It's fucking deep, man. Christ. Alrighty. I think we ride this thing now, so... We then end our uh, video once again by riding something. Um... Let's do it. Hopefully this won't go for too long. You want me to do? Oh. Okay. Let's do it. Uncover the source of Shenzhen Su's pain. Where the hell are we? Hold up. Hold up. Oh, we're nowhere. How crazy is that? We're just sitting here on the back of this turtle and we're not, we're just out in the waters. In the middle of nowhere. I wonder if we're on the other side. Whoa. That's crazy. I wonder if we're on the other side of the, uh, of the world of Warcraft. What can we do? I am in pain. But it's so am I, in my heart <laughs> that Lang's grandchildren have not forgotten me. There is we live on your back, bro. In my side. I I cannot remove it. You mean to tell me that guy just fucking killed himself because this bloke has a thorn in his side? Shenzhen 
Tetsu. But your shell is large, and I do not know where this thorn could be. It is in the forest, where your feet do not walk. Continue along the mountains, and you will find it. We will find it, and we will remove it. You have our word. This motherfucker just riddled us. Here we are, here we are. Ready for a quote. We will know soon enough. Oh. I thought they were gonna go into real like trippy shit there. Be like Because even the biggest things are you seeing what I can see? Pain from thorns in our sides or some shit on that. The horde, right? We're not very good at flying, uh, flying ships. <laughs> we 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 fly everything drunk. <clears throat> um. <laughs> this guy's like sitting here. I just like drop down from the uh, from the roof. We're like, hey, bears. What's going on? We're just talking to the uh, the uh, turtle no one's talked to in a million years. What's up? We can do business. The entrusted turtle talking to someone that's only level 11? Yeah, bro. That they did. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go hand this quest in and we're gonna wrap it up for tonight. Uh, unless they start talking again, they'll probably up hate. You have the eyes of one who has traveled much. Okay. So, so guys, thanks for <coughs> coming and chilling. I'll uh, fix up that uh, playlist for Quest to Level Cap, just so it's all in just one thing, so you don't have to go searching through the entire channel if you want to watch. Uh, if you are so inclined to watch. Uh, whatever part you're up to uh, next um, but until next time guys uh, part two I filmed today I filmed part two and part three so uh, they will probably be going up on the channel on Wednesday Australian time um, tomorrow on my channel or so Tuesday on my channel I'm gonna be or today actually because it's after 12 um, I'm gonna be putting up my heroic Ragnaros the Fire Lord kill on Hearthstone um, so you have that to look forward to, um, but obviously that will already be posted by the time you see this video. So, uh, until next time we, uh, jump back on the Bashiok, um, our Pandaren monk that has to, uh, what are we gonna do? Open the Mandori village gate, open the Peiwu forest gate. I think we gotta fight, uh, some orcs or something. Um, so next time when we remove the, uh, the thorn from, uh, Shenzhou Sin's side or whatever his name is, this is Bashiok. Stand by. <laughs>